Hey, uh, this is Mr. Royks. I'm going to take you through this quick problem uh, dealing with a weak acid uh, and setting up a nice chart and then solving eventually for the pH of our weak acid. So uh, they give us the information that it is a 0 0.4 molar acid with a Ka value of 1.6 e to the negative 6. So first thing is uh, set up our ice chart. And since they don't tell us what the acid is, we just are going to use the generic acid form. So we have the acid, HA. Again, A could be any anion of that weak acid. Um, going to H positive and the anion, which would be some negative charge. And then um, we're going to start with the initial. The initial for the acid is 0 0.4 concentration. Initial concentration of the hydronium ion or the hydrogen ion is zero. The anion would also be zero. Uh, change. This is going to decrease by X. This will increase by X. And then the equilibrium line is uh, where we add the initial and the change together. So it is for uh, 0 0.4 minus X. And these are equilibriums will just be X and X. So once we have that, we can plug that into our equilibrium expression. Just a reminder that our equilibrium expression, Ka, is going to be equal to uh, the concentration of our products, which would be the hydrogen ions and the anion, whatever that is, over the concentration of our reactant, which is the acid itself. Remember that we can ignore water. We don't have to put water into the equilibrium expression because water it doesn't have a concentration. It's 100% and therefore has a concentration virtually of 1. So it would just be 1 and doesn't change anything. Uh, so now we can plug in our values. So we're going to have concentration of x times the concentration of x over... 0 0.4 minus x, and that will be equal to our Ka value, which is 1.6 e to the negative 6. And uh, just a reminder that since our Ka value is to the negative 6, we can do the little um, drop, the, the change of x, because it's not really going to make a difference on our initial, the, on the concentration of the acid itself. So we can drop that. Again, if it's the, the rule that we go by is if it's e to the negative fifth or smaller, we can drop the change in x. So we end up with a equation that looks like this. 2x squared over 0 0.4 is equal to 1.4. 6 e to the 6. So once we have the equation set up, we can then solve for x. If we solve for x, hopefully your value matches my value, and I have x is equal to 8 e to the negative fourth. All right, and remember, X is really describing the concentration of hydrogen ions. So if we want to solve for pH, we need to do the negative log of the concentration of hydrogen ions. And if I take the negative log of 8e to the fourth, that is going to give me uh, a pH of 3.1. And that's how you deal with a weak acid in solving uh, using an equilibrium expression. See you in class.